down on that skill, Davio. Yes, Danita. They showed up. Ah! <laughs> I knew you'd do that. Ah! <laughs> you did it again. Well, we're definitely not having the meeting out here in the snow. Let's go inside. What? Ah! But park it out here. What's our status, Koki? Less than a minute of air left. Uh oh. Maybe this beaver can hold his breath for longer than we thought. Um, Chris, Martin, what's that dark tunnel? I don't know, but he's heading up. Prepare to surface. <sighs> Where are we? Inside the Beaver's Lodge. Whoa! There's a whole beaver family in here. Hey, we, we know, know these, these beavers. beavers. It's Timber and Sticker! And Buddy! And Twig! These are the same beavers from the summer! You're right, Kevin. They are. But it was warm and everything was green and they were eating the leaves and twigs. But now it's cold and everything's snow-covered and no leaves are growing. So what do these vegetarians eat in the winter? Well, whatever they have in the fridge, of course. Fridge. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> fridge. No, I'm serious. Beavers have a fridge. Of course, that's right, a natural fridge. Beavers collect branches with leaves and twigs in the summer, and they store them in the cool water right at the entrance to the lodge. The chilly water keeps the sticks fresh all winter, and <laughs> it's all right there whenever a beaver wants a snack. A natural refrigerator. That means the hardworking beaver has collected and refrigerated all the food the whole family needs for the entire winter. Can we just hang out with them and warm up for a little? <laughs> this year, once and for all, we've got to find a way to get rid of the wild rats. Uh, aren't they called wild crats? Whose side are you on? I am so sick of them helping the animals. It always ruins my inventions. And my meals. That crab would have been a culinary delight. I did not particularly care for the time they let the Dracos fly from my jewelry, either. Uh, don't those lizards glide, not fly? <sighs> Whatever, Davio. They... they are just so annoying! So is your whining. I'm not a whiner. Yes, you are, Zach. I'm not. Oh, yes, I'm not, you I'm not, are. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. Ah, my Finder's Keepers collection. <laughs> If someone loses it and I find it, I get to keep it. <laughs> ah, but it is missing something. I don't have anything in here from those annoying wild rats. Zackbot, are you in position? Well then, improve signal. What are those wild rats up to? Are we almost there, Jimmy? I'm going as fast as I can. The Arctic is pretty far away, you know. It's as far north as it gets. Like, the North Pole. Oh, I know, but I gotta find my creature souvenir collection right away. Did he say creature souvenir collection? It's all of my creature treasures. Creature treasures? Oh, boo-hoo, who cares? They remind me of our adventures. Blah. They're things of natural beauty. Blah. And sometimes, they help give us creature powers in a pinch. Blah, blah. <gasps> give you creature powers? Well, then I can't let you have it. You and your creature powers keep messing up all my plans. Anything that makes it harder for them to use those annoying suits is well worth it to me. I'll find their lame creature souvenir collection before they do. Besides, it'll make a perfect addition of my Finder's Keepers collection. <laughs> Jackbox, get my warmest jacket. We're going to the Arctic. Uh-oh! It's winter now. How 
are we gonna find Chris's creature souvenir kit under all this snow and ice? Well, this is what the Arctic looks like most of the time. It's the harshest cold weather climate on the planet. My collection is somewhere under that snow, and we've got to find it. Okay, so where exactly were you when you used it last? Well, okay. Down in that valley was where we helped the muskox herd fend off the wolf pack. Remember that? Oh, yeah. The musk oxen did their patented defensive circle to keep the wolves at bay. And in the middle of the fray, it rose up in front of me. A piece of shed musk ox fur. If I could catch it, it'd forever remind me of this incredible creature moment. Did you catch it? Not exactly. Why not? Well, just as I was about to grab it, I kind of sort of got in the way of a musk ox. Aww. But the fur floated down right on my face. So you got the fur. Did you put it in your creature souvenir kit? No, not then. I had to stay focused on the battle. But after we fended off the wolves, I headed back to the den to see Baby Tooth. It was later that day that I put the piece of fur safely away. I put it right beside the baby tooth that Baby Tooth, the Arctic wolf pup, gave me. And that's what you were doing when I called you at the den. Whoa. Come in, Green Wolf Pack. This is Blue Ox here. We've got a battle brewing here, bro. Are you talking about what I think you're talking about? Oh, yeah. Headbutting battles of epic proportions. I'm on my way. Oh, I can't miss that. Muskox, here I come. I rushed like crazy, but I definitely remember taking the collection with me. <laughs> 